Yo guys, welcome to Aperture Fitness. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to do the bar pullover. The bar pullover is an amazing beginner to intermediate exercise that really challenges your abs and your back and is a great way of setting up for straight bar dips if there's nowhere else to do them in your park. Remember to subscribe to the channel if you want to see more calisthenics content like this. Now let's get it. Hey. The bar pullover is an impressive calisthenic skill that also doubles up as a great back and abs exercise. It's relatively quick to learn and leaves you with a feeling of complete body mastery once you're able to do it. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to achieve your first bar pullover and tell you all the tips and tricks I know to get it looking controlled, powerful and MAGNIFICENT! So, let's start with the technique. To set up for the bar pullover, hold onto the bar with your arms shoulder width apart and initiate an active hang. An active hang is where you hold onto the bar whilst pulling your shoulders down to engage your back and shoulders. If you'd like to hear a more detailed explanation on the active hang, then please watch my toe to bar tutorial video. Next, pull up as if you were doing a regular pull up, but at the same time swing your legs up towards the bar. The faster you swing your legs, the more momentum you'll have to get yourself up and over the bar, so make sure to bring your legs up as quickly as possible whilst you pull up to ensure that you get over the top. The first key to mastering the bar pullover is to visualise pulling the bar towards your waist as you pull up. In order to rotate over the top of the bar, your hips must be in contact with the bar as you come over the top of it. By pulling the bar towards your hips as you come up, you'll make the rotational portion of the movement easier. Having your hips in contact with the bar will also make the bar pullover easier because once you reach the apex of the bar, you can let some of the weight of your body rest on your hips. All you need to do at that point is shift your weight backwards so your legs fall behind the bar and then push yourself up to complete the movement. The second tip to mastering the bar pullover is to tuck your body in as you rotate. Tucking your body in as you spin around the bar will increase your centripetal force. In other words, the more you tuck your body in, the faster you'll spin around the bar. This makes the bar pullover easier because it allows you to take advantage of the momentum created by your legs, so you don't need to rely on strength alone to get you up and over the bar. The third and final tip that will help you unlock the bar pullover is to keep your hands fluid. As you rotate over the top of the bar, make sure you allow the bar to slide through your hands. If you grip onto the bar too tightly, you'll not be able to rotate over the top, so soften your grip just a little so the bar can pass fluidly through your hands. Once you're at the top of the bar, push up to complete the movement. Engage your abs to stop yourself from swinging and to get that look of complete control. You can come down from the bar safely in one of two ways. You can either lower yourself down by performing a straight bar dip into a hang, or you can swing back round the way you came and lower yourself down. Personally, I prefer the latter because it's a bit more fun and you feel like a boss when you pull it off, but give them both a try and see which variant you prefer. So there you have it, that's how to perform the bar pullover. Thank you for watching, if you found the video helpful then let me know in the comments below and if you think your friends would find this video useful then make sure to pass it on to them. This has been Ashton with Ashton Fitness, now go do that bar pullover.